Dangerous cold finally starting to move out is welcome news for people looking for a way to stay warm. A local woman has been without heat for days. Local 12 meteorologist Scott Dimmick shows us how she's struggling to keep warm. Well, for the last two days, we've had no heat and no water. Rose Griffin lives in the Outlook at Clifton Apartments on Riddle Road. She has been looking for answers from management as to why her heat has been out since Sunday night. There's no reason to treat people like this. I'm never late with my rent. I've lived here four years. Like I said, we love the place. But no, I'm not going to tolerate this. Rose has put up blankets on her windows to keep the Arctic air out, but frozen pipes mean Rose can only get a trickle of water from her tap. Neighbors have been looking out for each other until repairs are made. When I came down here to, to check on my neighbors, it was brutally cold. Brutally. They, they might as well have been on their balcony. When the Cincinnati Health Department visited Rose this morning, they said the temperature in her apartment was around 50 degrees. But Rose says late last night, the temperature dropped between 30 and 40 degrees. And when it's that cold, even protected from the wind, you can get frostbite in less than two hours. This afternoon, Rose found a note from management at her door. We are currently working on the resolve the issue, and we'll get things back to normal as soon as possible. Local 12 reached out to the owner of the Overlook at Clifton, Town Properties, for comment this afternoon, but they have not yet returned our calls. Until the problems are fixed, Rose will continue putting the heat on apartment management. I'd like for them to fix stuff and not have to go through this again, because I will move. I'm meteorologist Scott Demick, Local 12 News. Now, a plumber was at the apartment building today to try to fix the problem with the water. Management gave Rose a space heater.